This episode is brought to you by the number 20, seeing how this is our 20th part of this Let's Play. Hey guys, it's Game Universe 13, back with Super Mario Sunshine. And the last time we got the Watermelon Festival done, how about that? I mean, one of my least favorite missions done so early on, and now we're going to do the rest of them. And we're going to go back to episode 1, because we've got that obstacle course to do, and my cat Homer thinks it's okay to sit on my guidebooks when I'm trying to record a video, and he still doesn't get it. Silly cat. Anyway, okay, so, yeah, that, that's the thing about my cat Homer. He likes, likes my video game guidebooks for some reason. I don't know why. Now, this is the only red cat I crack because, you know, it dispenses a blue coin. And my cat is being a little bit of a pest right now. Watch out for that one. Huh. Watch out for the little catacrack there. Wouldn't be cool if catacracks had to do, had something to do with real cats. That would be nice. And you know what? I don't care that my cats um are gonna be sitting on them. I don't really need them. Actually, I need them a lot. Homer, get off though. Oh. <sighs> Homer, we can do this. Ah uh, man. You know what? I'm just gonna move them on top. Uh, you know what? It doesn't really matter. I mean, I barely ever use it anyway. I mean, I pretty much know the game, so why am I even concerned he's sitting on them? Okay, so here's the red coin mission. This time, you only have one minute. So, go! And, yeah. Now, this mission is pretty easy because of flood. I mean, seriously. He doesn't make the sand castle or anything around it much of a problem. Like, see, you can just take this shortcut right here. I mean, look how easy this is. You can just hover to everything. It, yeah, they... Whoa, whoa, whoa. And though it makes it easy, I die. And so, yeah. Cow. Okay, let's try this again, but this time with 100% less fail, if possible. Okay, activate the little button and run. And now my cat is rubbing up against me. Anyway, enough about my cat. I mean, if you want to hear about my cat, then I'll, by all means, you could, but I'm not going to talk about him right now. Um, I mean, I've mentioned him a few times. I've mentioned him my other cat a few times. Okay, six right there. Now, for the others, they're up on the top, and they're on the sides of the same castle, like over here and stuff. See? And there it is, at the beginning of the little sandcastle. Save yourself. I'm gonna just slowly go down. Like that. And that's the shine sprite for you. And now time for the other secret one, and since there's only one obstacle, as the rule implies, it's going to have to do with something hidden in the level. And it is a really good kept secret, while well, at the same time, yeah, I don't know. Now, it doesn't really matter what level you do it on, actually, but for sake of everything, I'm going to do it on level 6. I mean, there's not that many cataquacks, um, you know, well, at least not as much as there should be from level 8, so really. So, basically, all you have to do for this one is something simple. Just go up here, and you'll see that there is a lone thing. 
stairs. Now hurry up and squirt the wall as fast as you can, revealing the shrine's bright image. Did it. And that's it. Yeah. Only problem with it is, it gives you a very short amount of time to do it. So, if you're not really good with time restraints, then this is one of those missions that is going to be difficult. Just take the nice little shortcut that was given to us. And, there we go. That's the other hidden one. That's 60 shine sprites. We're already halfway there. And I'm not going to be singing that song, okay? Even though you, it would be pretty obvious, I'm not. <laughs> now for the 100 coin mission, it's really bright right now. I mean, did you see how bright it is? Wow. <laughs> I mean, look, it's like really bright. I mean, it's reaching over there and stuff. Man, we really brightened up the place. Anyway, now let's go to episode 8 again, and it's like, what? I don't want to do Watermelon Festival. Don't worry, you don't have to. That's for the 100 coin mission. Yeah, relax. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I don't know. So, anyway, 100 coins. This is the mission I would suggest because of a few things. Uh, one, there's a bunch of catacracks. Those are one, add up to one coin each. So, all the way, you got a good bit of coins from that. Two, the main way you're going to get coins for this is from the watermelons that you don't need to get because those supply um, a good bit of coins and this that was just terrible I mean did you see that it just fell off like I'm gonna leave that coin alone then again one coin could make the difference as I always think like if I'm seeing an, I think I might have mentioned this but why not mention again if I see someone else let's play a game like this like Super Mario uh, 64 or Sunshine I'm like, grab that coin right behind you. I mean, every coin's gonna count in the end. I mean, like, they miss a chain of coins and they just for say forget it, you know? Well, yeah, well, it could be the difference maker and you get it done easier, faster, not waste as much time in the video, you know? If only I could tell them that. Now, there's a blue coin up here, so that's nice. And there's four regular coins, which is the thing we actually do need to get. A lot of. A hundred of. Now, I always wondered, what does Mario do with the coins he collects in all his games? Like, does he buy the go-karts from the Mario Kart Adventure, or what? What does he do with them? I mean, in the RPG series, is, um, he uses them to buy, like, items and stuff, obviously. And I just glitched. But, you know, still, what does he do with them? Uh, I don't know. Like... It could it there be it could be on like a wiki site or I don't know. It's actually probably not even explained. So why am I even asking this question? Anyway, back to the matter at hand. I mean, really. Um, man, I'm just getting off track. And I'm just babbling on about random stuff that doesn't need to be babbled on about. Okay, so on to uh, 100 coins. Uh, we have 17 right now, so that's an okay start. Um, these things aren't going to help you, so you can just forget about them. Well, maybe this one will. I don't know. Is it a decline or an, it's an incline? Or, I don't know what you would call it. Is it going to fall down or rise up? That's the really answer. Okay, so you got this cabana shack, right? Or, I guess you could call it. The roof is actually clingable. And you get four regular coins and a blue coin here. What do you know? Well, I know, so. I don't know. What do I know? Also, there's something important with a Yoshi here. Yep, Yoshi's in this level. So, yeah, just work on these uh, cataquacks very if you want. I mean, they give you a good bit of coin. It's inside of him. I can't get it now. It's inside of him. Did you see that? Like, it's inside of him. Yeah, normally they just go the direction you're jumping in, so. So, yeah. Easy. Easy to get coins, and it just went through the surfboards. Yeah, so just basically hit the crowded cracks, and there's a Yoshi. Who's there? No, wait, is that an earlier level I'm thinking of? Yeah, that's an earlier level. Never mind. I think that's actually level 6 Yoshi's in. 
now I think about it, because... I don't know. Anyway. Oh. And, so, just... For right now, we're going to spray these catacracks. For a few easy coins. I mean, it's just one coin at a time. How is this going to help us? Well, every coin counts. I mean, really, think about it. What if one, you didn't do, like, hit in one catacrack, and then that was that one coin you needed? I don't know. Think about it for a second. Yeah. Okay, so now we can take this watermelon to the shack. But wait, this isn't the one I'm gonna need. Yes, but they actually give you stuff about for the other ones. And you also get a coin every watermelon, so really, it's a big... This is actually probably your best bet for the 100 coin mission, because, you know, you get a, wa a coin every time you mess up on moving a watermelon. I mean, really, it's pretty... There's got a lot of good ways to get coins in this level. And that's why this is probably one of the only ones you can actually get it in. I mean, actually, you probably can... Yeah, you can get it in every level, but I would suggest it in this one. Because it's easiest. Now, here you don't have to worry because, well, it's not the watermelon you need to carry, and it's pretty small, so... It really leaves a good bit of room for error. I'm like, the last one. I'm not going to worry about it. But, if you go behind the shack... Yeah, this is the one also. If you dive down and swim to the underside, there's a bit, good bit of coins. Yeah, there's coins under the surf shack. And a blue coin, actually. I forgot about that. I thought there was a blue coin other than a yellow coin, but uh, I didn't know. For certain, now I do. Then just swim under it again. Pretty easy. Um... Let's see here. Yeah. You know what? I do want to get that watermelon there because it's just going to bug me the rest of the episode. Actually. You know how that one thing will bug you for the rest of the day or something. I mean, I get that a lot sometimes. Like if I, if I don't do well on a test or if I... I'm proven wrong about something by somebody or something, then I just feel, feel awkward for the rest of the day because I'm, I don't know. I mean, it's, it happens to everybody, I guess, you know, you feel awkward for the rest of the day, you don't really know why, and then it's just because that one reason that you know it's the cause of, but you don't want to really say it's the cause of it. I don't know. I mean, I don't know if there's a name for it, um, yeah, or if you're right near, right standing by a a friend or something at a place and and you don't want to know if it's them or something or if it's just, you know like one time I saw somebody on TV and I thought it might have been my friend but I wasn't completely sure and I haven't seen this friend for, for like ever so oh no 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 that's too small tiny really I guess I'll have to choose one of those three over there well, yeah, but it's bigger than the ones over there, first off. Second off, look how many coins it gives you. I mean, look at it. You, a shower of coins from these watermelons. And did you, I mean, why would you, you know, did you waste that good watermelon? I mean, really, it's a good watermelon still. A watermelon's a watermelon, unless it's not a watermelon. It's just one of those average melons you see. Now I'm just going off topic, okay? No, I'm, I do that sometimes, you know. Now I'm not going to worry about that one because it's too far away. That's my excuse. It's too far away. Just like how... I don't know. It's, you want to go somewhere and it's like, oh, it's to a football game and stuff. It's like, oh, it's a away game that's too far away. Because you just want to be at the home games. That's how I am about high school football. I mean, I just want to be at the home games. I don't want to, like, drive to the next town over. In the next county over. Just to go to the next game. I'm like, you know, I mean, if you're on the team, it's easy because, you know, you got the bus transport, but then you got to drive if you're a spectator. And people who actually do uh, drive to the away games, I have, like, a good amount of respect for those people because they, they, they're very supportive. I mean, yeah. Oh my god, it went into the wall. Are you serious? <laughs> Down here's four coins you can get. 
Nice four coins. Continue on. Not today. <laughs> and another one goes in the wall. Oh, by the way, they don't. The coins don't respond if you haven't noticed. What? Oh, man, it's been fucking what's up there? Anyway. Let's go and get the others. Now there's a bunch of coins over here. This is probably where you're going to get a good... Or a, a lot of your coins. I mean, see the watermelon right there. Well, gee, what's the point of that? You, you can score the birds, actually. And that's how you get one of the blue coins. And, and let's see if I can do that right now. Get the blue coin from the bird. Oh no, he's flying in the direction I can't get it. But, here's a good way to get coins. Anyway, um, so hover over here. The thing you can't get past earlier. Which is the watermelon. I'm lo Did you see that? I was practically, like, levitating and stuff. Now, you want to make sure you're over here. Now, down there is the, uh, is a blue coin and two coins. So, get that, uh, as you're here. I mean... That's nice to get. Not really needed, except for 100% completion. So I guess it is needed. Anyway, you want to be on the tight ropes. See? Tight ropes. Then you want to jump as high as you can, I think. I don't remember where you want to be. I would say right in the middle of it, about right here. Jump, 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 and I'm not going to get up. I'm not going to get up, huh? I need the rocket nozzle, huh? Ah, uh, this is embarrassing because I didn't know if I needed the rocket nozzle or not, and now I do. Well, that was pretty cool. I mean, I triple jumped on a slanted surface. Oh, and look at that. There's a blue. Sorry. Uh, yeah, by the way, there's a beehive. See, you can um, get a blue cry crack down and hit him for a blue coin. Now it makes sense, huh? I mean, does it really make sense to um have a blue cry crack in a field with weds and then not have it? Or okay, so your rocket nozzle is probably what you're gonna need from now on. I mean, this is important. Good bit of coins around that. Uh, blue coin right there. And I gotta pick up the face a little. Blue coin right there, so yep, that's 73 of them. And now we get the rocket nozzle for this level. That's nice. Press and hold are like I have told you a million times. I don't know, I'm not good at robot voices. And now we're up here conveniently. How about that? That's how you get up there, okay? You gotta use the rocket nozzle as you jump. That's 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 what I was missing. Jeez. Rocket nozzle, I don't see it any you uh, with any you use. <laughs> I'm just messing around now. For like the watermelon festival in all, so just do it use it for right for this now. And there's actually good bit of stuff you can use it for, I guess I'll do that as long on along the way. I mean look how far you go and then see it's a pretty easy way to get around. Just keep rocket jumping out. And if only mankind itself could rocket jump, that would be neat. Now it's kind of hard to get to some places. Okay, just jump over here. And that's not where I wanted to go. That's not where I wanted to go. No, that's not where I wanted to go, man. Yeah, it's very tricky at times to get to where you want with these things. You gotta angle it correctly. Huh, this is gonna be fun. This is gonna be fun indeed. Oh, no, 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 ah, man. That's pretty much the reason I don't like using the rocket nozzle, because it's so hard to control. And, you didn't, and you're gonna need the rocket nozzle, because, you know, how are you gonna get up there with the, um, regular one? You can't. And it's not like they supply another one. So, you're out of luck. And whoa, I did not mean to grow a tree, but, um, I don't know, whatever. Now, bees are gonna sting you, obviously. You're right near a B. 
beehive. Stupid bees. Rocket now is able to get a good bit of coins and a blue coin. And I'm running. I'm running out of ideas of where to go to get coins. I mean, really, we've pretty much hit everything. And what sucks is this is supposed to be the mission you get it in. But really, how are you supposed to get it? And man, I'm at the 20 minute mark already. Wow, this might be a very, very long video. Actually, sadly, I did. I mean, I don't. It's nice to have a long video. I mean, people get this done. You know, get this done quicker. But still, you know, I, I know people don't have the time to watch these videos. I know I don't have, have the time at some point. Sometimes I got to go somewhere at uh, so and so time, and I have five minutes to do that, and I want to watch a quick YouTube video. And if so and, so, and one of my favorite um, YouTube people have posted a long video, I can't watch it. No, no, I missed it again. Oh man, I'm gonna have to refuel all the water. Man, this is just bad. Man, I'm sorry. Sorry, guys. This is just, this is just terrible. I'm sorry. I did not really want to make it such a long video. Oh, turbo nozzle is right there if you want it. And uh, you know what? That's a, that's actually a nice shortcut. I'll use that. Uh, whoa, whoa, don't land on it. See, nice shortcut right here. So we're covered. We're still covered. No, man. Man. Okay. There we go. Now that we're up here, maybe we can get the rest of them. I don't know. This I might actually have to get that last watermelon. I just realized that. And save myself. Yes. See how hard this is? My cat's doing something weird. Great. Chasing something around or something. Man, this is going to be my longest video ever. Congratulations. Huh. See, now if you're... Okay, that's what I was doing wrong. You got to be kind of like parallel to it. Okay, so be parallel to it when you jump. Now it's time for the fun part. See? There's a good bit of coins. So, walk, jump, and dive at the same time. And you should have been able to get those coins. I'm not going to worry about them. God. Uh, gee, I'm running out of things to get. Um, am I going to fail the 100 coin mission? Because if I do, I mean, that would be sad. I mean, I don't want to fail a 100 coin mission. Those, those are tough. Yeah. And I'm saying man too much, so maybe I should stop saying man. Hit you in the head because I feel like it. Huh. What did I miss? Gee, there's a rock nozzle right there. Um, I'm gonna switch back to the hover nozzle because I don't want, I don't need it anymore. I need the, I don't need the rock nozzle. Um, God, what did I miss? I mean, I guess I'm gonna have to get this watermelon over there. I mean, if all is fair, I can just smash this watermelon against something and then, yeah, I could do that. Smash the watermelon. I'm going to just get this watermelon over there, and then anything else I need to get, I'm going to get from the big watermelon at the top. That's what I'm going to do. See, one corner at a time. This will take 15 smashes, so... You know what? Yeah, that would be probably the easiest way to do it. Smash it against something for 15 times. There. Okay, we're just going to do this, okay? We're going to smash it 15 times. I'm sorry I have to do it this slow. But, uh... You know, kind of have to. Uh, man, my cat's going crazy right now. Man. This is not the ideal way to do it, guys. Okay, don't smash a watermelon a hundred times to get a hundred coins. But it's what's come to, actually. I mean, they were really mean with this one. I mean, they were. You know, I think we're at the point where I can, we can just deliver this watermelon and be good. Okay, almost there. Oh no. Okay, this is gonna be a hard part. Um, and do I wanna go straight? Yes, I do. I'll go straight. Okay. Get back to the watermelon very quickly. Just get this over with. Oh, 
Almost there, almost there, almost there. Okay, good, we're there. Wow, 25 minutes already. Man, this is going to be a crazy thing to upload. It's going to take forever. I mean, so, actually, it depends on how my internet is going to be doing today. I mean, seriously, like, sometimes it wants to work, sometimes it doesn't, sometimes it's slow, sometimes it's fast. Like, sometimes I can have a 20-minute video that takes uh, two hours to upload, while I can have another one that takes four hours to upload. I mean, and if it's one of those slow internet nights, it's going to be, like, five hours for it to upload. I don't know. Okay, just take this to this guy, and then we're good. Hmm, well, that's not bad, but not great either. It's not bigger than any of those three over there. Yes, it is! Did, did you even compare sizes, man? I don't know. Did you really compare the sizes? Swim, 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 swim. Aw, oh, man, two coins short. What do we do? Well, only one thing to do when we have two coins left to get. And then we're on a... And we have some... The only thing we can do now is just smash a watermelon two times. That's all we can do. I mean, I can't think of anything. Anything? I can't think of anything to do for these last couple coins. I mean, we've gone everywhere. We've done everything possible. We've smashed all the cat cracks and stuff. I mean, there's nothing we can do but this. Let's take this watermelon and smash it against something. Pick the watermelon up and... That's one coin. Time for the last one. And then we finally got a hundred coins on this level. I mean... I didn't think it would take this long. Okay, I'm sorry. Just uh, one of those things, you know. We don't plan. I don't plan how long my uh, video is going to be in advance. No, nobody does that. I just decide what I want to do in the video, and if I have time for extra, I will do extra. But I just plan what I'm going to do. And I was planning on doing those t two missions before and this. And really, not a good plan. So, let's just, just long dive over there. Not get smashed by a No, I am not dying. Thank you very much. If I died, I would I would just do it off camera. Because I'm. you saw me do it. So, I don't know. Not going to catch me. Not going to catch me. Not going to catch me. And there's the shine sprite. And... We've done it in 28 minutes. <laughs> okay, so next time, let's go back to Peanut Park, and I will see you guys then. Goodbye.